what is up hello welcome to or welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is emma and if you're not new here my name is still emma here is the video that you guys have been waiting for i did a little teaser about this on my instagram by the time this video goes out that probably would have been two weeks before this basically it's asking you guys how much you thought i got paid doing youtube for the whole month of december because as you guys probably know i did vlogmas and instead of carrying it out until the 25th of december i was like i'm on a roll i'm just gonna carry on going so i did it for literally the entire month of December so I uploaded I think in total it actually ended up being 32 videos because I had to do like an extra video for merch announcement for 32 videos within 31 days I'm going to be telling you guys how much YouTube paid me basically YouTube pays me in monthly lots so it gives me throughout the month like estimates of how much I'm going to get paid and stuff and it pays me for one month at the end of the preceding month that was a really bad way of explaining it for december for the month of december i won't get actually get paid until the end of this month but i've been given like an estimate of how much i'll get paid per video and in total so i'll be sharing it with you guys today right let's head on to instagram and i'll read out some of your guys guesses and we'll see kind of what you guys were thinking what the majority was thinking so i chucked this little thing up on my story and said how much do you think youtube paid me for uploading every day of december as you can see when i this is what happens when i do things on my story this is like how many replies i get so um we won't be reading them all obviously okay so we've got 100 2000 1k a tr 100 trillion wow that's that's a long stretch. 1,300, 1,000, 10k, 200, 1,300, 20, 15 bucks a video, 5 bucks, nothing. 1,000 to 10,000, 50 bucks, 7,000, 5,000 to 2,000, 20 to 70 dollars per day, 1,000, 50 US, 1,500, 15 dollars, 3,000, 1,000. Big old fat payment. Well, I am now going to reveal to you guys how much it actually was. I feel like you guys were either like a little bit optimistic or a little bit pessimistic. I've sectioned it off into each video, so I'm going to tell you literally how much every single video works. So to give you a bit of like background information on it, YouTube pays you like on a basis like kind of like per thousand views so they have like a cpm so when you go into a youtube creator studio which is where you control all your videos when you're posting them when they're uploaded replying to comments all that sort of stuff it's like a separate website a separate app and everything you can go into your video so if i click on the analytics which is basically all the numbers and stuff to do with that video it has an overview so it had five and a half thousand views 97.7 .7 watch time in hours so people's overall spent 97 hours watching that one video. I gained 35 subscribers from it, and my estimated revenue from that one video was $18.78. So if I head over to the revenue tab, you can see here that my estimated revenue was $18.78, which is what it's showed on the other page. But then the estimated monetized playbacks is only 4.2K, even though the video got 5.5K views. And that's because there's those people out there like some of those people that will be watching this video right now who have YouTube Premium. So obviously I don't get paid for ads in their videos because there's no ads being played. Playback based CPM for this video was $8.15. So that's like an average because like some countries, like particular ads, you might get more money than other countries. And as you guys know, like ads are tailored to each individual person. I never choose what ads go in the videos. That's purely based on what you click on, what you're searching, what you're watching. If the video's over 10 minutes, I can choose where the ad goes, but I can't choose what the ad's gonna show. So it could show something that's completely unrelated to anything that I would ever watch, ever look at, but because you guys look at it, that's the ads that you guys get. So basically, to explain the CPM, I'm going on a whole big tangent here, but it's basically how much YouTube expects, on average, you'll get paid per 1,000 views. So obviously, as you can see here, that doesn't really make sense because the CPM is $8.15, and if you times $8.15 by 4.2 thousand monetized views, that actually is $34.23, whereas I only got paid $18.78, which is pretty much half of what I would expect based on the CPM. So for Vlogmas Day 1, as I said, CPM of $8.15 and I earned $18.78 and the video was only 1 minute and 57 seconds long and it had 5,500 views. So I guess for the length of the video, that is, isn't that bad because you'll see as I go through, I've got like a little list up on my laptop here. So yeah, the second video was a merch announcement. This wasn't actually part of Vlogmas, but it was a video that I still uploaded in the month of December. So this one had a CPM of $9.54, had 8.8 thousand views, the video was just shy of seven and a half minutes long and I got $38.76 for that which is not too shabby at all. My bake with me, that had a CPM, that had quite a high CPM, that was $13.97. Consequently I had nearly 7,000 views and I earned 40 
$5.48 from that and that was also over 10 minutes so I have heard I already heard this last week I feel so stupid that I've been on YouTube for literally nearly like two years and I need to found this out but videos over 10 minutes get paid up to like potentially up to three times as much as a video that's under 10 minutes and I'm like why did I not know this? So my videos now will probably be more than 10 minutes because I mean as a viewer I feel like you get more out of it when it's more than 10 minutes as well. I am very guilty of making my videos shorter than 10 minutes so for you guys and for myself I am now going to try and put videos out there for you guys which are longer than 10 minutes. Next up we have Summer Bucket List. CPM was quite low for this, $5.69, so I only earned $11.60 from that one. Weekend in Hamilton, $7.05 CPM, and I earned $21.39 from that. So as I say, like, the CPM, that had like 8,500 views, so I should have got with that CPM like, what, 7 times 8? fifty-six. That took me way too long. So I should have got three times as much as I did for that video but because it's only an average and not all views are monetized you know it's it's very hard to tell like you guys can see why you can't really rely on this as a full-time job because I'm obviously I am definitely like a small youtuber I'm not like you know thriving out here for million subs I still do make enough like kind of pocket money from this so cleaning out my wardrobe $9.91 CPM $25.70 I earned from that and I'll just read out the earnings for you guys from now $20.29 $23.86 High school graduation vlog, that got removed, so I got nothing for that because shout out to my friend, I'm not even going to mention his name because he'll probably report on my other videos, but I put him in that video and I can't remember whether or not I asked him to be in it. Anyway, um, he reported it and he thought that that would just show up in my thing and basically just say like fix the whatever as a joke, but no, YouTube took down the whole entire video and now I can do absolutely nothing about it, so that's great. Um, Vlogmas Day 8 is now missing. And so is my graduation vlog. $45.41, $28.09, $8.86, no, $16.83, $14.86, $10.21, $45.86. So as that one actually, that, wow, that video had a really high CPM. $17.79 is very, very high. I think that's actually the highest of all of Vlogmas videos. Yeah, it is. I don't know why that is. It was over 10 minutes long, guys. That's why, because it was 11 minutes and 17 seconds, even though it only had 5,500 views. It was over 10 minutes long. $19.35, $14.24, and $9.78. That's a bit sad. $27.56, $11.33, $11.41, $29.40. Song of the Decade, that got nothing because all 50 songs in that video got copyrighted, so that's fantastic. $3.99, that's really poor. They had a really bad CPM of $6.06. $88.95, so again, they had a really high CPM of $10.06, and it also got 23,000 views. $9.57, $46.91, that is also because they had a high CPM of $15.62, so I don't know why that is, but oh, it's over 10 minutes, oh my gosh, literally over 10 minutes is the key, guys. If your channel has been monetized, and you're on YouTube, Make your videos over 10 minutes and don't make the mistake that I made. $21.65, $13.97, $10.49, and one second every day, 2019, was $12.16. So, unless you've been sitting there with a calculator, which I doubt you have been, and you're now wanting to know, okay, Emma, cut to the chase, how much did you get paid? You'll find out right after this ad. Sorry, that was like really mean. But the total was $706.74. So as you saw as I read through that list, a lot of videos get paid a lot more than others. So the lowest was $3.99 for my day in the life, which is absolutely pathetic. And the highest was $88.95. So as you can see, it fluctuates like crazy. I will probably be getting a lot of questions in the comments if I don't address this. But, well there's two things. To get your channel monetized on YouTube, you have to have over a thousand subs and have over four thousand watch hours. So I think it took me like, just over a year pretty much, to get that. And my first payment was 69 cents from YouTube, which was, yeah. It's really cool that you can do a hobby and get paid for it. And obviously, I'm gonna get questions on this if I don't talk about it, but... YouTube, I'm not in it for the money, guys. I know that doing this video, guys are probably like, oh, she's just trying to show off and show off how much money she gets paid from YouTube. But I know that you guys are genuinely curious. I get so many questions about it, and I didn't want to address it in a way that I was open to talking about it, because obviously I don't want to tell you how much I get paid for every single YouTube video, because some of that stuff I do need to keep confidential. But this does give you a pretty good idea of how much I do get paid for doing YouTube, because I know that a lot of you guys want to get into it and want to know if it's worthwhile and I get a lot of people saying oh are you only in it for the money no if you want to be in it for the money you need to have 
an excessive amount of subscribers because for me right now as you guys can see here seven hundred and six dollars and seventy four cents it would have been way more beneficial for me to just go and get a nine to five job but then I wouldn't be able to do vlogmas for you guys and I want to be able to do vlogmas I want to be able to put out the videos I hope this kind of addresses your guys questions and whatever if there is anything that I have missed and you do want to know the answer to it feel free to just check it in the comments below I do go through and heart rate you guys comments and everything and answer questions if there are any that pop up so feel free there are some things that I'm obviously not telling you guys like more in-depth stuff about YouTube but that is just for privacy reasons and things so please don't ask anything more about like money figure side of things but if you want to ask questions about how the whole monetization thing works if i know the answer i'm happy to tell you guys um as you know i'm not that clued up about it all as you <laughs> as you saw and i said that i didn't know that 10 minute videos got paid for apart from that thank you guys so much for watching if you made this far in the video please give a big thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and check out my website if you haven't already if you didn't know i i well i had merch but there will be more stuff coming in the next couple of weeks i haven't actually said this on here but thank you to everyone who purchased a hoodie in the last round of hoodies i did if you guys didn't know i had merch i'll chuck some photos up on the screen so you guys can see what it was basically i sold 71 hoodies which is absolutely crazy i literally thought i would be lucky to sell 10 i donated five dollars from every single sale to Starship Children's Hospital here in Auckland. On behalf of you guys, I was able to make a donation of $355, which was literally like the nicest feeling to be able to just like give that money to someone or like an organization that you that needed it. Yeah, you guys are incredible. Make someone smile and I'll see you in our next video. So yeah, that's great. I forgot what I was gonna say.